well grand kings and queens welcome back to my channel so today i'll be making sorrel only this time it, i will be adding pineapple now it's the first time i'm trying this and let me tell you i love i loved it so i'm just going to go ahead and show you guys how i make it it's pretty similar to my last sorrel video my regular way how jamaicans make it if you missed that video, I'll leave it up in your eye card. I'll also leave it down in the description box, so make sure you check that video out. And without further ado, let's get straight into this video. And Merry Christmas when it comes, guys. So as you can see, I have my pineapple right here, which is the star of the show today. And make sure you wash your pineapple well, guys. I already went ahead and washed mine because you're going to need the skin. As you can see, I have my ginger, my sorrel, my rain nephew overproof rum, and of course, some lemon juice and my Jamaican cane sugar. So now I'm going to peel and cut up the pineapple into smaller pieces. I wasn't cautious, you know, about how I'm peeling it, just because I'm just going to let it steep. I'm not eating it, but if I was going to eat it, then, you know, I would peel it and clean it up better. So, yeah, guys. Maybe when the bright lights start to fade, fire up your lighter, float on with the waves. You make me feel light, light, light. You make me feel light, light, light. You make me feel light. Like you want me hit the spirit like a damn car tire Endless loving and it can expire I was such a never answer prayer You know I say You got the love for my body when you hold me And if you call me we come Baby me now let you go Love it so this is all I've got when I was finished and what it looks like and I'm going to put everything now in the pot um, to let it steep overnight and guys if you've reached this far don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already hit that notification bell beside the subscription bar like comment and share this video with your friends and family so as you can see right here I have my boiling water now I'm going to add the sorrel, the pineapple, and the ginger, and of course the pimento berries and let it steep overnight. It's like a seed in your reaper you saw. Oh, maybe when the bright lights start to fade, fire up your lighter. so this was the next day and i'm so excited because look at how rich it is and the pineapple turned color of course it absorbed that red color and it smells so good it looks so good and when i'm finished i did try it and it tastes so good so since this is not a traditional drink in jamaica let me just go ahead and break this down for you so it is known as sorrel in the caribbean islands sabolo in ghana zobo in nigeria and bisa pretty much throughout west africa so what is sabolo? Sabolo is a hibiscus drink made from hibiscus petals, not to be confused with hibiscus tea. The hibiscus used for this drink is said to be indigenous to West and East Africa. It may have made its way to the Caribbean by way of slave trade. Different cultures make this drink very differently. 
So when I say this is not a tradition in Jamaica, meaning not sorrel, meaning adding pineapples, and I get to understand that some places in Africa they add like peppercorn, like black pepper. They add like cloves, dried chilies, cinnamon, oranges. I've never tried it with all that. So probably next time around I'll try and definitely let you guys know what I think. Let me know what you think about all these different cultures and how they do stuff differently. Drop it down in the comment section below. So this is me of course training it a second time just to make sure that I got rid of everything I didn't want it in it and yeah. Now I'll be adding my lemon juice and of course my brown cane sugar. And last but not least, the real man in the party tonight, or rain if you white overproof rum. I don't know. No sorrow. No sorrow. Tastes good without the rum. And of course, if you're serving kids, don't. You can leave out the rum. And if you don't drink, you can simply leave out the rum and still enjoy this delicious drink. Okay? This is the end of my video. I hope you all enjoyed it because I did. I enjoy creating something new and it was so good. I would recommend everyone trying this until my next video. I hope you all have a good week and Merry Christmas when it comes. Thank you for watching. One love. Bring that home, me need it like a home, you need my lungs. Turn up the pressure, make this thing get dumb. And when you're blessed, you know me now, I'm sit bad. But like, it's against the